You would know nothing about the sport, nay, the art of the go-kart. You're being really rude right now. I'm just saying he crashed and he hurt his, his face. You just, you, you're just you being really ignorant right now, what? as usual. And I dare you to take me on. You think, well, you think, you think you know the cart? Dare you to take you on. Do I what? dare you to take me on. Okay. Go-kart race. Oh. Dare oh. just happened. No, 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 no. Hold on, hold on. Yes, okay. yes, yes, yes. Wait, no, I'll take your dare, but I'm going to double dare that Whoa. and double dare you to go-kart me blindfolded. What? Whoa. Yeah. Oh, that, that's, that's, you're scared. Oh, no, 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 I was just, I couldn't, I was, this hand motion lured me. So I'm, I quadruple dare you to what? try and beat me in a go-kart while blindfolded with obstacles, because oh, oh, I'm not afraid oh, of that. Oh, I'm not hell afraid. Hell no, you did not. Oh, hell yes, no, I just did, did. I all did right, it. All right, all right, I mega dare you. Oh, mega dare. Oh, yeah. That's the mega dare. Mega dare? Mega dare. All right, well, here we are. It's Mega yes. Dare time. Oh, hey, guys. How's it going? I uh, just happened to be at the Foot Locker down the street, and I thought I'd pop over and uh, help uh, judge a competition. Thanks for being here. You surprised me. No problem. Listen, you guys are going to be blindfolded, but I still want to tell you what you're going to be up against on your course. Ten obstacles stand between you and total victory. To get to the finish, you'll need to successfully navigate challenges like the Pyramid of Coolers, a blow-up doll menage a trois, a stack of pies, and at the finish line, one single deadly Mouse trap. Now, as I said, you will be blindfolded that you know. So we're going to give you the benefit of, of selecting someone as a co-pilot, a trusted confidant yes. that you believe will help guide you uh, trustfully through the course. Uh, Olivia, let's start with you. Who have you brought with you today, near and dear to you? I picked the person who pushed me out of their vagina. I picked my mother! Hey! Oh, Kim! You, any words of encouragement for your daughter today? Um, she will be a winner. Uh-huh. You're a wiener? A winner. A winner. Okay. A win. Kevin, now uh, you brought someone near and dear to you as well. Uh, there's a very strong familial bond going here. So uh, who have you selected to be your trusted co-pilot? Chris, I brought Miguel. I brought, brought Miguel. Is this your uncle? Is this your uncle, Miguel? I believe he says his name was Carlos. I, I, no, he's telling you his full name. His name's Miguel. I, I, I grabbed his name. His, name, his name's Carlos. Did you get him at the Home Depot? I, well, you, you know, it's not like I got him. Maybe he's there. All right, guys, uh, co-pilots, if you can step off to the sides, I want to get these competitors in their carts. You're going to see you're going to have a bucket full of things you can throw at each other if you can navigate and do that at the same time. So let's take our places. Who We can, we can see who absolutely will be the ultimate in the Mega Dare Challenge. Total victory. Listo, listo. Listo? Ready, ready, right? Listo. What the hell is listo? Get set! You can't see this flag, but go! There goes Olivia pulling out. They're really <laughs> pulling out. Go straight, send your right. throwing straight ahead. Oh, oh my god. Carlos, talk to me! Carlos! Hey, the Kindle survived somehow. Yeah, go, go around. They missed the baby and the puppy. What? Oh, Olivia's gonna hit the coolers. And he has flattened Olivia on the course. Oh. Fuck you. Yeah, that's you. All right. Gnomes, dead. Oh my god. Where's the door that happened? Olivia's still stuck back in the coolers. Um, I think we're flying in a medevac to her. I'm not 100% not sure. See, not my daughter. I adopted her. Uh. What happened? Uh, keep going. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Keep going. Kevin seems to be trapped in the middle of the course. Right through the pies. Ah, oh, kind of a weenie. Go through the pies. And he has snapped the mousetrap. Kevin Pereira is the winner. Well, I'm not really sure what's going on. Olivia's still way back there on the track. I want to go home. Look at you. Am I driving? How am I moving? That's right. Wait, am I moving? Oh, you're stuck again. Okay, go ahead. Are you go ahead? Where? Go straight. Yeah, go, 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 go back, go back. Olivia finished the race, and down go the pies. Mun, you're so close. Should I win? No. Yeah, Mom, I'm not asking you. All right, Kevin, what happened out there? Chris, several things happened. Uh, I think the Portuguese are known for two things. One, sexual stamina. 
obvious, right. two, our navigational prowess. And I yeah. think I proved that today. And first, I'd like to thank, of course, a big baby Jesus. Uh -huh. And I'd like to thank Eduardo here. He's phenomenal. Carlos, man. Oh, Carlos. You navigated the course pretty well up until the end, and then the guy, and then the blindfold came up. What happened? I hit the wall super hard, and all I could hear was, uh, yeah, Miguel was just screaming Carlos, bloody Carlos, murder, Carlos. and I was, I thought, I, I thought I heard Olivia, and so my instinct was just take it off. You took off your goggles? You, you navigated the course pretty well up until the, the wall, the, the coolers, and then, uh, then, then you got a little hung up. Well, my, my microphone was cutting out completely. I couldn't hear anything. All I could hear was I was saying straight, straight, good, good, good. Well, you were going straight, straight, and it was good, good. Oh well, well then, I'm sorry. Yeah. Well, at the end, I knocked right into a pie, and I hear her go straight, straight, yay! You were directing me into the pie. Look at my pies. She knows how much you like pie, so she thought it was a good thing for you. But listen, we, we, we went to the judges to get a ruling on what happened because Winner. technically your goggles did come off even though you were first. The judges ruled in favor of Olivia. What? It was a disqualification. What? So, I was concerned for your safety. You're a frail Asian. Well, it's exactly this type of fire that makes Attack of the Show number one with tweens and inmates. Thanks for watching Megadare here in the fabulous city of industry. We'll be right back. So, see you guys. We are all tied up now, so suck it, No, you know, that's BS. No, we're not. Whoa. Yeah, no. Exactly. Look at that. We're not. Just because the graphic says it so, that's not an official graphic. I don't trust it. What? It is. That's official. I was concerned for your safety. No. So I How did you maneuver around the entire thing of cooler? Portuguese navigation skills. No. Yeah. I think you could see through this part Star of your glasses. I taped star charts to the inside of my goggles so I could navigate by them. Well, you cheated then. I, no, I didn't cheat at all. Okay, it was totally legit, you, and I you, totally won, and I'm glad. I would glad. still like to review the tape and see how you're able to maneuver around everything so easily. What are you talking about? I hit a lot of stuff. Well, if you actually want to no, see you, us, you like, smash won. some stuff, you will see that later on in the show, because we were like, we finished the course, and there was still plenty left to demolish. There's a lot, yeah. So we decided to have some fun, which yeah. you will see at the end of this well, show. Which, which resulted in, in a table directly uh, into Kevin's head. Yeah. He thought it was, uh, he thought it was going to be breakaway. I saw fruit on top. I'm like, that's not going to hurt. I didn't realize it was resting on a table. Whatever. <laughs> Very well. Until the next Mega Dare. Mega Dare. Want to uh, also give a big thank you to Speed Zone. Uh, they, we really had an amazing time there. They were yeah. very great, and they let us drive very irresponsibly yeah, and, on their uh, course and make a huge mess. Oh my gosh! I heard that they were not so happy with the mess we made. Oh really? Yeah. Hey, we're attacking the show. What'd you expect? Well, I do thank G4's art department for cleaning it up too because yes, they did a damn you. fine job. Great job, guys.